you won't even think about jumping in front of a train. Mm -hmm. Like you, it's not even like, so um, if your girl is the same girl that she was prior to you having a child, I think that's a big problem. Do you think that it's, dif it's more difficult like for, like, okay, so a child comes into the situation. Am I dragging it? Okay, sorry, forget it. I'll talk to you tomorrow. <laughs> I'm gonna call I'm gonna TMU. Do you think? So just, I guess, what was your transition like from business? You said doing finance and then in, into real estate investing. Like, what was the transition like into the uh, okay. podcasting space? Um, it was a, it was a, I stumbled into it actually. Like Joe, Joe Button and I have been friends for decades now. When he was pump, pump it up, huh? yeah. <laughs> like, right? So, um, I used you to get mad. You know, we just for, like we just already friends. So we, Joe and I argue off camera as hard and as much as we argue in, on camera. So when you see us arguing, that's organic. Um, for me, I'm a talker, right? Um, so, so the tra and it was, it wasn't a hard thing. The hardest part for me was the cameras and, and talking to strangers. I'm, I'm super shy by nature. So that was a hard thing for me, um, to just be on a, a national platform. Like that's still hard for me, to be honest with you. That's still hard for me. But, um, the podcasting thing it, is really just talking about some shit you know about or some shit that you learned about and giving your own opinion. I think that, um, some of the best podcasters that I've seen, are um diverse so the diversity to me i think is is um maybe my biggest strength like i could talk about sports passionately i could talk about relationships passionately i could talk about business i could talk about parenting i could talk about a whole bunch of shit and lend my perspective to it a lot of people can't like um you could take uh some of the best if you watch first take stephen a 